Disneyland may still be the happiest place on Earth, but many Disney corporate employees are feeling grumpy. More than 2,000 of them from all the Disney companies have signed a petition pushing back against the mandate to return to the office four days a week. And it's more than a request. In addition to saying that the forced return would dramatically reduce productivity, the petition warns that it'll lead to forced resignations among some of our most hard to replace talent and vulnerable communities. Guess we'll see who blinks first. The British man behind the infamous 2020 celebrity Twitter hack is coming to America. A Spanish court has agreed to extradite Joseph James O'Connor, who was arrested in Spain in July of 2021. You may recall his handiwork from the summer of 2020 when he managed to hack into the Twitter accounts of several big names, including Barack Obama, Joe Biden, and Kanye West. He then had their accounts falsely promote cryptocurrency. For the hack, O'Connor's facing multiple charges, including money laundering, internet fraud, and extortion. And if you managed to see this on today, February 21st, well then, welcome to Fat Tuesday, otherwise known as, pardon my French, Mardi Gras. Yes, sadly for many, Wednesday is the start of Lent and also the end of carnival season, which has been raging on in New Orleans since January 6th. But we can be grateful we're at a point in the pandemic where people are willing to party hardy. According to a Wallet Hub study, over a million people made it to the city this year for official Mardi Gras celebrations. Well, time to go earn some beads while I still can. See you in a bit for more headlines.